hey, I have a new TV show on Newsmax TV on Saturdays at 7.30. Tune in. You'll enjoy it. Happy Memorial Day. And just a moment of prayer again for those poor, poor children who were gunned down and for their families who will who have had suffered an irretrievable loss. And last week in a video, I urged uh, arming teachers. And I've thought about it. I've spoken to a bunch of experts about it, and I've reconsidered that. I think that would be a mistake. I think that if we arm teachers, we're forgetting the difficulty of shooting a shooter in a busy classroom crowded with children, with teachers who are not professional shooters, uh, who lack the training to be able to discern their target and who are probably nervous as hell because they're being shot at and are not used to firearms, it would be, it may be a disaster. And they don't know about things like the ricochet of bullets or bullets going through one target and hitting another. And uh, it could just cause unbelievable collateral damage. So a better proposal that I'd like to make is to go back to a proposal in the Clinton administration, which we did, which was to hire 100,000 additional cops at the time, it cost us about $12 billion and probably would cost twice that now or even three times that, but not an unaffordable amount. I think we should have four cops in every single school in the country. There are 25,000 schools in America, and so it would be 100,000 officers just like we hired in the 1990s as a result of President Clinton's initiative. And uh, I think that that is the answer to this problem. I think that if you have four armed police officers, either on duty cops or veteran combat veterans who sign up for that or people who are similarly qualified or trained, uh, I think that that can deter any shooting and will stop it completely. To see the rest of this video, please go to dickmorris.com backslash subscribe uh, to sign up for my videos and columns. It's completely free. Or click on the link in the description box below. Thanks.